Hey guys, how's it going? I uh, hope you guys are staying safe, staying home, because of, you know, because um, of quarantine, but, uh, yeah, uh, so I know I haven't been making videos as much as usual, but uh, that's, that's normal, it's, well, I mean, I'm, well, I'm already dying, you know, like, I don't even barely get any views, but I don't give a crap about that, I, I just don't care about entertainment, so, um, yeah, today we'll be looking at, uh, we'll be covering all, every single Black Ops perks in Zombies, uh, so not World at War, um, maps and games and all. So only, no call, just Black Ops, so, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy, and subscribe, like, and comment for more challenges, and yeah, let's go. Number one will be Juggernaut, the most popular perk in Zombies. What is Juggernaut? Juggernaut slash Dare Wonderfizz which old players used to call it, can give you one more hit till you're downed. Example, a zombie will need to hit you one more time till you're downed. Number two is Quick Revive. Now there is two versions of Quick Revive. In Co-op Zombies, which is multiplayer, when a player is downed, you revive them a lot more faster. But in Solo Zombies, once you're downed by a zombie, you'll be revived automatically in seconds and back up, removing all your perks. Moving on will be Speed Cola. Speed Cola lets you reload 50% faster with any types of guns, including Wonder Weapons and Rocket Launchers. Next up will be the Tombstone. Now if you're down and dead, but spawn into the next round, you'll have all your guns and perks, except the Tombstone itself. Note that the perk only is valid in co-op, not so not solo. Coming up to the next perk will be Vulture Aid Elixir, short for V. Once you buy Vulture Aid Elixir, you can see where the perks are and the mystery box. If it is your first time playing the Black Ops 2 Buried map, it'll come really handy. Next up will be PhD Flopper. This perk will give you resistance to explosives and full damage, so if you keep getting annoyed when you accidentally kill yourself with a ray gun or any types of explosives, including grenades, or just if, or just love exploding stuff in general, this might be the perk for you. Now if you guys don't know what stamina up means, it's really obvious, but if you guys don't know what it means, that's alright. Basically, you get more extra speed. Mm, yeah, that's actually all. You just get more speed, you're, you become more faster. Moving on to Meal Kick. Now what Meal Kick is, is you just get an extra weapon slot. So that means you get three weapons at once. Next up will be Deadshot. Now I know we're not going to be talking about World at War games, like different kind of Black Ops 2 games. Like we're only talking about Black Ops games. But we'll talk about uh, World at War. So World at War Deadshot is uh, you get a 35% better hip fire and accuracy. But in Black Ops, you'll get extra damage to headshots. 